In the entire state of Florida, there are four cases of people who have tested positive. In the entire United States, the virus has infected at least 210 people. 12 people have died. Congress approved an $8.3 billion emergency spending bill to fight the virus. We have team coverage tonight. News 6's Lauren Cervantes is standing by with how the virus is impacting a major health conference set for Orange County. But we begin with News 6's Nikki Zizaza, live at the Orange County Administration Center with the latest. Nikki. Lisa, the tone at this briefing this afternoon was to quell fear surrounding the coronavirus. Orange County Mayor Demings, along with health care providers, say they wanted to address the public, you know, in the midst of all this panic surrounding the coronavirus. Now, the briefing was aimed at ensuring residents of Orange County that health officials are prepared for the threat of COVID-19. At this time, there are no confirmed cases of the coronavirus in Orange County. However, the mayor says he has been in contact with state lawmakers and health care officials to address and anticipate any concerns as they rise. Now, while there is presently no reason for fear countywide, Dr. Raul Pino with the Orange County Department of Health urges the public to take all the recommended precautions. Take a listen. I've um, trained for this and prepared for this through the many epidemics that we have in the past. I would like to remind the public that we dealt with Ebola, we dealt with MERS, we dealt with SARS, and we were always prepared. Now, health officials say they want to make sure the public knows they are not aware of any cases surrounding the coronavirus. However, they are going to continue monitoring methods as things proceed. For now, I'm live in Orange County. Nikki Zaza getting results. New 6.